come along because we're going to discuss the three disgusting reasons why you should keep that valve shut until you're ready to dump. If you stay to the end, I'm going to have a little bonus for you just in case you really just want to keep those gray tanks open. Okay guys, so let's just go ahead and get this one right out of the way because it's the most disgusting one there is. And it's the black tank. Now you should really not keep the black tank open. Why? The number one reason. And we all know the number one reason. Nobody wants a poop pyramid. If you don't know what a poop pyramid is, you don't want to know. <laughs> okay. Basically, if you keep your black tank valve open, what's going to happen is all the liquids are going to run out. Therefore, all the solids are going to remain in your tank. That is where the poop pyramid begins to happen. So, boom, number one reason. Don't keep it open, keep it closed. We want to be able to keep the liquids in there so that way when you do end up releasing the tank, it does a funnel effect and sucks all the solids down. Let's go to number two, okay? Well, number two reason is with the gray tank. If you keep it open, nobody likes the smell of your black tank anyway. So why are we going to bring in smells of everyone's poo into your rig? Because what happens is the entire system underground is ventilated. So the air, when you open your valve and keep it open, air is going to go with the least resistance. So it's going to travel right through your rig. Do you really want the entire campground sewer system going up and out of your rig? No, I don't. So number two, boom, shut your valve. Okay, in number three, we've all been disgusted by this one. When you go to hook up, and you open the drain pipe up and nothing but flies come out okay do you want those flies flying into your rig no absolutely not we already get those little pesky gnats we do not need to bring in the sewers flies and they will travel they will go wherever they can go and you and that would be the least of your concerns because you don't want a rodent crawling up and getting in, in the insides of your rig. So yes, let's close that valve too. Now again, with the gray valve, you want it to be two thirds of the way full because again, you want to make that funnel effect. You want all the solids to be able to get sucked down. Okay, if you keep that drain open then what happens is all the sludge and everything builds up on the sides and you're basically just like a river it's gonna have walls okay and you're building sludge walls in your tank so again keep the valve closed and build a funnel effect now we do use happy campers in our rig and I'll leave a link below for that that helps deodorize the tanks and honestly, since we've been using it, it has cut down to like no smell at all. And there was a little smell coming up and I really didn't like it. But since we started using that product, it actually has done the job that it states it does and not many products do that. Okay, so on to what I promised you, the little trick at the end. What I've heard is, and I haven't tried it because obviously I close my valve. Okay, if you are trying to keep your valve open, not saying you should, but if you are trying to keep your gray tank valve open, then what they say is if you keep it so the water level, because you have this big dip here, that what's gonna happen is both sides are gonna fill up about that much. So it pretty much builds a wall on its own of water so therefore you're not going to get the rodents in there or the insects yeah if you wanted to do it that way you could but you're not stopping it from building those walls of crud keep that in mind all right well i know this is short and sweet maybe not so sweet because we're talking about poo tanks but it was short and to the point 
If you like this video, please hit that subscribe button and give us some comments below on what you do. Do you keep your tanks open, closed? Do you do that little trick at the end? Did you, has anybody heard of that trick? Or am I just the last one to hear about that trick? Anyway, so have a great day guys. Thanks for watching.